I'm Anil Kumar. Welcome to my series on trigonometry. In this playlist, you will find many videos which are good for grade 10 students, especially those who are taking CBSC board exam. The question here is, find the value of A and B if tan A plus B equal to 1 and cos A minus B equal to square root 3 over 2, where A plus B is between 0 to 90 degrees and A is greater than B. Now in this particular case, we could solve this question using special triangles. See, whenever you get tan of 1, think about 45 degrees, correct? So the special triangle of 45 degrees looks like this. So this is your 45 degrees and the sides are 1, 1, square root 2. The other special triangle is 30, 60, 90. Now these are the two triangles which you should always remember, right? As soon as you see the value of square root 3, don't think much. Just draw 30, 60, 90 triangle. So this angle is 60 degrees, that is 30 degrees. The sides are 1, 2 and square root 3. Now once you have that, then let's look into the question once again. We say tan of a plus b equal to 1. Now tan of a plus b equal to 1, we are also given that a plus b is within 90 degrees, right? So it is less than 90 degrees. That means we are only concerned with quadrant 1, right? Now here, Clearly, tan theta is 1 means A plus B is equal to 45 degrees. Perfect. The other equation is cos of A minus B is equal to square root 3 over 2. Now, if you look into this, cos is adjacent over hypotenuse. So, it is A minus B equals to 30 degrees. Correct? Remember the ratios. What is tan? Tan is opposite over adjacent and cos is adjacent over hypotenuse. Correct? Keep that in mind. So when we say square root 3 over 2 then we have to look at this is the adjacent side right? and that is the hypotenuse for angle 30 degrees. Perfect. Now basically that gives you two equations to work with. One a plus b equals to 45 and the second one a minus b equal to 30. Now these two equations should help us to find the value of a and b, right? So if I add equation 1 and 2, what do I get? Let me do it here itself. So if I add equation 1 and 2, then 2a is equal to 45 plus 30, right? b minus b will cancel. So 2a is equal to, we can add this, 5 and 7. So a is equal to all this is in degrees right 75 degrees divided by 2 so that gives us the value of a as 37.5 degrees perfect now when you subtract it you can get b but you could be get b otherwise also now from the equation you can say let's say from equation 1 We know B is equal to 45 degrees minus A, right? So we can get the value of B from here. Good. So A plus B is 45. So B is equal to 45 degrees minus 37.5 degrees. You can use calculator if you want to. 45 minus 37.5 equals to 
in decimal 7.5 degrees. Now look at the conditions. We have condition A is greater than B. So our answer is A is equal to 37.5 degrees and B is equal to 7.5 degrees. You can check when you add them you get 45 and tan of 45 is 1. Correct? So that is how you could do it and when you subtract you get 30 degrees and cos of 30 degrees square root 3 over 2 and you can clearly see that A is greater than B. So I hope that helps. Feel free to write your comments, share your views and if you like and subscribe to my videos that would be great. Share your questions. Thanks for watching and all the best.